Anytime you're ready, I'm just kind of falling asleep in these loading screens. It's time to meet the starting lineup. For the Phoenix Suns. We are live from the U.S. Airways Center for a Western Conference contest featuring the Suns here in Phoenix. Right now, the Rockets, they like to start this road trip off on a positive note. They continue to spread the load trying to compensate for the injury. You're up. Let's go. Time to do my thing. Up in for more. At least he's psyched. Just under three and a half minutes gone here in the first quarter. Well, the Rockets, wouldn't you say, are really to be commended, Clark, for rebuilding this team without tearing it down to the start. Oh, my God, bro. Yeah, what the hell was that? I mean, you want Shaq in a fool tonight. But this is a team that's held the winning record in the West now for eight straight seasons. Mm. That's pretty impressive. It is. So on the floor for Houston. Terrence Jones is down low with Howard. Beverly and Harden man the backboard. And it's Covington in at the three spot. The three from Harden, and that is good. Oh. Harden's, Harden's bringing that heat. Triple, his first you know he is. A good open look, and he splashes home. All right, boys, it's beast. Jay Tucker, he's checked in for Gerald Green. D comes in for Eric Bloodson. And it's Isaiah Thomas in for Goran Dragic. Houston also making some changes. Monty Yunus is checked in for Terrence Jones. Terry comes in for Robert Covington. Oh, that, I think Cannon I just had in for Patrick Beverly. Just a dude in my face. And the Rockets showed great patience and planning over time, freeing up cap space, acquiring young assets. Yeah, that could have been better. Let's go. them to trade for James Harden and, of course, attract Dwight Howard in free agency, too. Come on, Thomas. Outside Thomas. One twenty-nine left in the first quarter. Here's Quinn. Terry covering. Ah. Foul called as he misses. He'll go to the line and shoot two. That's on Dwight Howard. Phoenix. And this Rockets team, for all of its success, is still young, still developing that. Still good. Make no mistake, they've elevated themselves from playoff contender to potential, potential title. Still contender. good. No swishes, but we making buckets. Jones checked in for the Rockets. Here's Kanan, averaging six points per contest. Harden kicks to Jones, kicks it out to Harden. Six to shoot. It's hauled in by Tolliver. Phoenix has gone two or four from beyond the arc to start the game. Thomas goes in. That is good. Nice, bro. Thomas got his coast first to coast of the night. And so it's Houston with it, trailing by two, fresh from a win against Portland. Yeah, that was a strange game. Very shaky defensive performance by their opponent. But hey, what hard to pass this way? Yeah, I'd go along with that. I mean, the game wasn't handed to them, but they definitely didn't have to work as hard as they should have. Five on the clock. Here's Harden on the mark with the 15 foot. You know he's not missing that. Harden's got five now. That's a clean look they gave him there, fellas, and he drains those. Outside Thomas. Thomas off a pick from Quinn. And Thomas, here we go. Puts up the baby hook. Oh, like Quinn, no good. too much traffic to work there contesting that shot that looked like it was going to be easy, but they forced the miss. You know what? Oh, he got shit. it in close, but couldn't finish in traffic. Puts it up from 12 and Harden damn gets it to go in on the assist. Wasted by it. That's seven points for James Harden. <laughs> he was closer. There's the buzzer and not much. score. All right. Is that halftime? But this is my last game as part of the second 10-day contract. So I really, really want to get a full sign. I don't know what would happen. Would they Miles kick me out? PJ Tucker comes in for Bill, you ain't Green. doing shit. D, he's checked in for Eric oh, I'm leaving my man. Thomas subbed in for Goran Dragic. Quinn in a shooting guard. Marky Morris is out there with Marcus Morris. Then it's PJ Tucker and it's Thomas in at the point guard. So that's the oh, line God. Of the for the Sun. Tipped. And as it goes out of bounds, Houston able to keep the ball here. That was an awfully risky pass, guys. Lucky it didn't wind up as a steal. Well, it nearly did wind up as a steal, but no harm done in the end. They hang on to possession. Terry's setting the pick for Howard. 
Six on the shot clock. Hard Get that, it's a good. mess. Rebounds are split just about down the middle in this game, Clark. I'd venture to guess whichever team oh! that energy level. That dumb do. Where did that come away. from? Well, Clark, a clear <laughs> lane to the basket and the emphatic jam. And that is outstanding attack. I was surprised. I thought I didn't have any activated. No choice but to take that one to the bucket. Let's go to our sideline reporter, Doris Burke. Doris, what do you have? Well, Kevin, the Suns bringing in Isaiah Thomas this summer. Coach Jeff Hornacek said, quote, Isaiah is another guy who can create a lot of things for us. We want to push the pace and keep it going for all 48 minutes. Who knows? Maybe I'll pull a little Don Nelson and put three point guards out there at once. Guys, that'd be fun to see. They love players who can create in the pick and roll. Doris, he fits. Here's Terry. Oh, I totally. Oh. Beautiful dish. It's all good, though. Goes down. And now just a one-point Phoenix lead. Great job to hit his teammate on that move, Kevin. And Thomas, here we go. Oh, whoa, whoa. He faked that? 24 seconds left in the first half. Quinn kicks to Morris. Nice. nice. To the pit play and make the Always got to find team. Morris. The screenplay worked ideally there, and I'm not talking about the screenplay you see in a movie theater. <laughs> Gave him more than enough room to get that shot off. Here's Harden. Oh, that's and a foul. foul on the shot. Got him on the way up that time, so he'll shoot two right here. We're still doing okay. No question about that one. You can hear the impact. Harden doesn't miss these this shots. This is his first trip to the line tonight. Well, he had a lot of success at the free throw line in their last game. He really did. He didn't waste any of those chances when he got them. And, fellas, I, I think you have to like his improvements over his free throw numbers from a year ago. It's not a significant number or, or a huge Shoot it. amount. But it oh! <laughs> Thomas making the buckets. Oh, a miracle heave to finish off the quarter. Good shot, bro. Now. A nice release and some good Woo! concentration as well. But the biggest thing about that, a whole lot of luck. Close game as we wrap up. Good the shot, quarter. man. That was crazy. That's going to give us a nice four-point pincushion. All right, listen up, everybody. The second half doesn't have to be. He repeats as himself. This is the same we shit. Suck my kiss. Neither side checking into the Rockets. Get up. You're going in. Here we go. Jay Tucker in for Eric Bloodsoe. Daniels is checked in for the Rockets. The Suns trailing. Taking a look at the Rockets. Oh, we're losing now. What the hell happened, bro? Power. Then it's Harden. Then it's Patrick Beverly. And it's Daniels in at the shooting guard position. <laughs> to tie. And Green Good gets shot. It to go. Green's got 11 That's points. a good play. Green's a good dude. He's straight. In for Phoenix. Isaiah Thomas comes in for Goran Dragic. And a change for the Rockets. Jason Terry. Troy Daniels. Here's Terry. Right now averaging 11 points a game. Gerald Green, hot and cold throughout his career. Drafted 17th back in 2005. Steve, oh, they just the let him go through. 2007 dunk contest champ. We were there to see that. Then out of the league for over two seasons. Well, Kevin, he was even waived by his teams in Russia and China. So uh, you think about how much he's improved. It's incredible. He's always had the talent to play in this league. I think, you know, Come on, baby. he had to figure out his niche and understand, you know, how to limit his mistakes. But last year... Uh, Harden's going drive. He's going drive. I know it. Harden kicks to two. No, he didn't. <laughs> Pass to Daniel. From outside the arc... Offensive rebound. Power. It's oh, and one. On the shot, so he will go to the line. Fuck, bro. A three point play chance here. That's it's hard, and he don't miss. Oh, not hard. It's Howard. In terms of where the oh, he missed it. For the he rocks. done fucked up. These long range shots look like layups out there, guys. Don't overlook the success they've had at the free throw line tonight either. Oh, well, man. Contact on the way up, and two shots coming up. Great job. Take it right at the defense. I like Mo Morris. Yeah, he left with no choice but to foul there. For Phoenix, they have made their free throws at a pretty good clip. They've hit 8 of 10. And Very good. Drops them both. I have my faith. 127 left here in the third quarter. Terry against Thomas. 
Dishes it to Harden. Pass to Howard. Back to Harden. Oh, that was a. Oh, he missed. That was a sexy pass, though. Four rebounds now tonight. Here's Quinn. And it's going to be two free throws. Drew I can't believe I didn't dunk shot. that. And Clark, hear about a special bond between players and coaches. Well, his old high school coach is here in the stands to, to watch him play today. Well, Kevin, you know it's always nice to see a familiar face when you're in the NBA. And no matter how many gaps you perform the coach had you run while you were a sophomore in high school, still good to see his face. Houston making a switch. Here. Still get it. Check in. Both free throws good from Quinn. Houston's gone downtown a lot since halftime. They've missed five of their nine attempts out there. Yeah, they've been fucking up. Dishes to Harden. He kicks to Terry. Takes it from ten. Good. It's Harden with Damn the it. assist that time. That was my bad. Harden's got three assists in the game. For Phoenix, they've gone seven of eleven. A lucky field goal percentage here in the third. Outside oh, watch Thomas. the screens. And Tucker has it in the He's all alone. The lead. And he gets nice. It. Tucker's That's the triple. His first points of the game on the deep ball. Mark and Steve, this uh, game has a lot of character here in the third period. Yeah, you know what, guys? I love seeing this type of action. A competitive, compelling matchup. A lot of lead changes here so far. Yeah, six oh, you left him right open. So this has been a, a great game. Both teams playing hard and really competing out there. Phoenix has gone into the three-point range four times since halftime and buried two of them. Five seconds separating the shot and game clocks. From outside the Bad idea. Oh! Got the triplet. I can't believe it. Got five points now this quarter. Here is Harden. He's got 13. That was a risky shot. The guy was in his grill. Oh! Harden. Woo! Good job, boys. Going to the, the fourth quarter with the lead. Tune in. It and it's time now to bring you our State Farm assist of the game. This was a substitution. Get up. You're going in. Here we go. And Tom is in for Goran Dragic. Terrence Jones has checked in for Houston. Terry comes in for Canada. Inside, it's Morris and Plumley. How we doing? Oh, we're up by what? And eight points. Nice. And the three spot. Who's out there for Phoenix? Well, their worst fear came. Howard's fouled out. Get out of here. Get to step in. Losing him to foul trouble will make it a lot tougher. Should I be closer to a B rating right now? I'm not. Well, if you're just tuning in, welcome. We've got about. Whoa! Well, he's getting physical. Here in the fourth quarter. Risky pass. Whoa. Another shot. A yes, Plum. From and the Suns lead by 10. He's enjoying himself today, guys. We knew going in that he had have the upper hand on the glass, but I didn't think it would make this much of a difference. Trying to get and that open look. Over. over to the wing. Jones with the screen on green. No good nice. off the front eye. And no excuses there. Got a really good look at the basket after being freed up by the pick. We say it all the time. Green! Was that assist. Not as good, but good ball movement anyway. You gotta love the use of the bounce pass there. Perfect feed. For the Phoenix Suns, they're coming off a good outing against the Kings in Sacramento. One forty-six left to play here in the fourth. And Beverly kicks to Harden. Can't get it to nice. Go. And Phoenix will what the, the fuck did you do? What did you do, Plumley? He threw it off the backboard. What a stupid move. Jeez. Houston also making some changes. Daniels, nice. he's checked in for Robert Covington. Terry comes in for Utah. And it's Cannon in for. What are they doing? Quinn. Great touch on the 16 foot. They got on this roll a while ago. Wow. They just haven't looked back. You know, from that in they were just standing range, there. That was just weird. I had to take it. Team. Well, when you make perimeter shots and oh, I could have stolen that. It opens up everything else. Oh, I let him go. Off the drive, and the shot is Fuck. good. And these are the types of games where it's obvious. My blocking isn't that isn't perfect. Tonight, 
going to be a great win by a large margin for Phoenix. Oh they shit, he's all open. Free throw opportunities. They sure did, Kevin. They shot much better, and that improved and one. confidence as a team. Woo! It was a team that believed they would make those shots, and that's just what they did. And guys, at this point in the long NBA season, this will go down. Give me that three-point play. They will walk out of here riding high. Perfect. A big win over a conference foe that they split their previous two meetings with. Steve, one more game left against them, and there's no doubt they can build off this win and beat them a third time. I want to get that B what rank. A huge standout performance it was for Eric Bledsoe. You look at the energy. Oh, come on, guys, get that rebound. The floor, and it's easy to see. We kicked their ass, though. Difference maker. Boy, where was the box out? Too easy on that second chance opportunity. Yeah, no box out is what happened there. Those kind of mistakes on the glass will kill a team. We've got 33 seconds left to play in the final quarter. Five to shoot. Here's Morris. Yeah! On the way up off the glass. That's the, the assist. Suns lead by 15. Well, this is gonna Always looking for open really looks. Exploded here Trying to be as unselfish line. as I can. You know, they Playing smarter in this the series. Water, the killer instinct came right out. Now here's Beverly. Why are you wasting clock? Terry outside. Shot from 12. That one Ooh. Off line to the I right want to keep my B rank. Looks like they're going to finish strong, but just aren't enough ticks left on the clock. Well, Steve, it's a good run they're having now, but they just waited too long. He's not going to bother. So it's the Suns winning easily here. That was great, this man. One was such a yes, guys. I'm Did amazing. They said I did fair. I think they could shove that up their butthole. I mean, for me, I did amazing for my. Shaking, baby. <laughs> these old balls. Hey, uh, so what'd you think? I think I was lucky to coach you as a high school player. You, you are a natural. Hey, thanks, coach, but I had a really great teacher. Oh. I gotta get to the locker room. It was good seeing you, all right? All right, I can't wait to see you. All right, man. <laughs> good job. Thank you. <laughs> My high school coach. <laughs> I was beasting in high school. <laughs> you know, life's a funny thing. Whatever you say, boss. <laughs> a couple of months ago, I never even heard of you. A few weeks ago, I was certain you were a one-and-done guy. You know, have your cup of coffee in the bigs and then disappear never to be heard from again. And now? Now! Well, now I'm going to tell you that I was wrong not to draft you. And I was silly to offer you only a 10-day contract. And you know, I, I was mistaken to think you were only here to have a cup of coffee. So, you're saying what I think you're saying? Yeah, yeah, I'm saying we're offering you a guaranteed contract for the rest of the season. I'll make you proud. Heck yeah! Man, that's what I'm talking about right there. Thanks, you're not gonna regret this. I'm telling you, I'm gonna make this organization so proud. Good, good, listen. You got he this doesn't like to shake because, hands. Uh, you've been working your tail off out there. You know, you keep doing what you're doing, and, uh, you know, there's no limit to, to what you can achieve. Uh, you got it? Yes, sir, I do. Get Thanks. out of here. Thanks again. Get out of here. He doesn't like being touched. He's your player, dude. Don't be a dick. That guy's being a dick. Anyway, I got me that permanent spot. Welcome to the film room, everybody. Coach wanted me to give you all a little breakdown on some of the key points of emphasis strategies we'll be using moving forward. As you know, the entire staff feels it's important to review the basics from time to time, giving everyone a better understanding of what coach is expecting when you're out on the floor. It's going to help the team win more games. Simple as that. Now let's get to it, gentlemen. Getting to the basket and playing physical on defense. So here we go. 
Now, there are times when coach is going to want us to really focus on getting to the basket. We have some talented players on this team who are capable of getting to the rim just about any time because of their ball handling, speed, and ability to finish inside. When we run into a team that has weak perimeter defenders or is not very good at defending the rim, coach is going to want us to go strong to the hoop whenever possible. Now let's take a look at some game film showing how we can try and get to the rim for some easy baskets. Here we've got a nice dribble drive play. The ball handler takes his defender off the dribble and gets all the way to the basket for an easy bucket. LeBron. When we go up against a team with poor on-ball defenders or a team that's not good at protecting the rim, we need to be able to take advantage. And on this next play, look how the ball handler sees a lane open up to the basket and quickly attacks before the defense can react. Easy score. If you've got a lane, attack. No hesitation. Keep these examples in mind when coach says he wants us to focus on getting to the basket. Okay, up next, playing physical. We've got some very physical players who like to use their bodies against weaker, smaller teams. We should be looking to take advantage of those size and strength mismatches by wearing out our opponents over the course of the game. Now let's look at some films so you guys can see what playing physical on the defensive end looks like in action. Here we go. See the defender pressing up on the ball handler? He's not giving him any room to move. You need to be up tight on the ball. Make sure you put a body on them to slow them down. The more physical we play, the better our chances of winning become. On this next play, the defender is down low, bumping his man out of the paint and further from the basket. That's what we need to do when coach asks us to play physical. When they're on offense, we need to lean on them all the time and just keep wearing them down. Okay, that's going to do it for today. There's no excuse not to know what's expected of you when coach calls for either of these points of emphasis in a game. See you at practice. You got it, coach. I'm the only one who speaks up. I look like a giant suck up. <laughs> so are you just going to stay? Okay. We're just going to sit here. Like, where's the, where's the, do we have snacks or something or what's going on? To infinity, where are your badges? Congratulations upgrade unlocked. Your hard work has paid off. Go to the attributes main upgrade menu and take the next step in building a my, my player unlike any other. New badge. You've earned spark plug because you've shown the ability to extremely effective off the bench as a score. This badge will help energize your teammates when you make big plays coming out of timeouts or coming off the bench. All right, let's get some of these equipped.